Hey guys, it's the Tech Dude. Hope you're having a great day. Today I want to show you the Galaxy Note 9 portrait mode and how to get great shots with it. Stick around and let's find out together. Here we go. Okay guys, as you can see, I'm here at a lake today. Uh, I'm going to be showing you how to do really nice Galaxy Note 9 portrait uh, pictures. So a few things you want to do for any portrait shot is find a background that uh, that looks pleasing to the eye. Uh, it will be blurred. Uh, that's part of the portrait mode. It has that nice bokeh effect. But you still want something that's that's that looks good and that catches the the viewer's eye. Another important step, guys, find a time of the day where there's there's nice lighting on your subject. Right now it's <clears throat> pretty early in the morning. Uh, as you can see, the sun's uh, to my east, so it should should light up this side of my face really nicely. But there's a pretty even light, I would say, out here. And one cool thing about the Galaxy Note 9 that I love is that the S Pen can be used as a shutter. So you can take really, honestly guys, you can take nice portraits of yourself um, if you don't have anybody around. So it, that helps. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started guys and show you a little bit about what you need to do to get that portrait mode. So here we go. So the first thing, first thing you wanna do guys, open up your Galaxy Note 9 camera. either by double clicking the home button, either by double clicking the power button or going to the camera icon down here in the corner. When you get in the camera, guys, make sure you scroll over to where it says live focus. That's what the Galaxy Note 9 has as portrait mode. And it'll come up and say, it'll give you some, some helpful hints. Like it says, you know, be three to five feet from your subject, which is very useful. So guys, once you get that up and running, go ahead and take the S Pen out if you're doing it. If you're doing a self-portrait, you're going to need that. And then stand about three to five feet from the camera. Make sure you pose really nicely. And click that S Pen for the remote. And you should have a very nice, very nice uh, portrait mode, guys. Let's see what that looks like. Beautiful. <laughs> Just kidding. I am not a model. Uh, I think it actually looks pretty good. The background's nice and blurred. Like I said, the left side of my face is very, very well lit. The right side's a little, a little dark. You get that Rembrandt light going on. But the background, look at that background, guys. Very nice and blurred. You can also adjust the background blur. There's an option down here. So if you want more, crank it up all the way, if you want less, crank it down. I like it right where it was, about um, level five, actually level five, level four-ish. Looks good to me. And guys, if you don't like the angle of it, there, the Galaxy Note 9 does take two different uh, pictures. It takes one with the telephoto lens and one with the normal wide angle lens. So you can actually go in here to the picture and select wide angle, and that'll do it, guys. That'll I like the close-up angle myself. Looks pretty good to me. I'm gonna take one more for good measure just so I can have another sample photo for you guys. Maybe pose a little differently for you. I'm trying to look stone cold like Fox, here we go. I think that'll do it, guys. Let's see what that looks like. You know what? I think that looks pretty good. Uh, you know, not to flatter myself, but looks pretty decent. That background looks really sweet. That, that blurred water looks very pleasing to the eye, guys. I really like that a lot. So overall, guys, I'd say the portrait mode in the Galaxy Note 9, or AKA the live focus mode, looks really good. It's easy to use on yourself, especially with the S Pen. Uh, also easy to use on another person. A lot easier because you can tell what you're looking at. Right now, I was just kind of guessing where I need to stand and everything. But like I said, three to five feet is the preferred distance for the, the portrait mode. All right, guys, that will uh, that about cover it. Hope you enjoyed this useful tutorial. Hopefully you learned something you didn't already know. Anyways, guys, I'm CE Tech Dude. Hope you have a great day. You just got CE Tech. See you next time.